The following portion of Daytime Blue Ridge is sponsored by... Choosing a facility that provides exceptional care for your loved one is an important decision. The Landmark Center has a community specifically designed for seniors, providing a number of services, and one of those services is respite care. And joining me now to talk about respite care is Melinda Collins, certified dementia practitioner. Thank you so much for coming Hi, in. Hi, thank you. So, first question, what is respite care? Respite care is a short-term stay, usually okay. one to three weeks. Um, most families will use that service if they're going out of town or if they're having some health problems of, you know, of their own okay. or simply if they just need a break, but it's short-term stay. Okay, and now what's required for, for respite care? We do require a history and physical from the physician and a, either a TB test or chest x-ray to rule out tuberculosis within 30 days prior to admission. Okay, now what do what does a family might need to bring for respite care to make sure they're prepared? Um, clothing items, obviously. Yeah. Um, any personal care items, shampoo, soap, you know, razors, um, mom's favorite, you know, perfume or lotion, and then medications. Okay, and that's it? They don't have to bring a bunch of other things? No, no. Everything will be completely furnished. The room will be completely furnished. So we just need your loved one and okay. whatever they'll need for their stay. That's great. Now, why would you choose respite care over like a long-term stay? Well, again, respite care is short-term. So um, okay. families will use it if they're going to be out of town. But also, they will use it sometimes for mom or dad or their loved one to kind of try out the facility to see if this is something that would work well for the loved one, but also for the family. Okay. Now, when somebody is, let's say somebody is interested in respite care, what should you be looking for? I mean, should you be kind of, you know, checking different places out, seeing what's a good fit? What should you be looking for if you're a family? Certainly. Uh, check around and, and, you know, do your research with different facilities, but you want to select a facility that's going to have residents there that are kind of like the loved one that you're searching for, but also look at, you know, what activities are offered. Are there going to be meals that mom or dad will enjoy? Are there going to be other residents for them to relate to during their stay that will make it enjoyable for them so that you don't have to worry quite as much? Yeah. Now, at, at the Landmark Center, there's like a whole list of things that you all do. What are some of the things that... that that they might get to take part in? Well, um, lots of activities within the community. I mean, arts and crafts, different church groups. They go out twice a week, um, usually shopping once okay. and then out to eat somewhere um, one day a week. They go out sightseeing. We have a, lots, a huge volunteer base that comes in and provides different services to our residents. Um, lots of card games, board games, um, pool. <laughs> There's okay. always something going on at Landmark. Okay. And then, of course, when you're trying to find uh, a place, a respite care facility, one factor you always consider is cost. So what's somebody probably going to expect to spend? For us at Landmark, um, our respite stay is $150 per day, and that is all inclusive. That includes their meals, any that activities that they participate in, um, housekeeping, laundry, any assistance that they may need from the nursing staff, medication administration, it is all inclusive. Oh, wow, okay. Mm -hmm. And if somebody wants to get in touch with the Landmark Center, what's the website phone number? Um, you could reach the Landmark Center at 276-694-3050. And then if your loved one needs a little bit of a higher level of care, Blue Ridge Therapy Connection also offers respite services. And you can reach them at 276-694-7161. Great. Thank you so much for coming Thank in. you for having me. And if you all want a link to their website, we'll have it on our website. Just go to DaytimeBlueRidge.com.